Engineering is the combination of science, technology and ideas all used to solve problems in industry. Engineering to me is something very new, I've never really understood how vast it was until I came to Lee College. People don't seem to understand that everything they touch or use has had to come through some form of engineering process. You learn a lot what goes on in the world by engineering. Applying those skills to everyday life and actually understanding how things work. The idea of having new challenges, new problems to solve every day. I think engineering is certainly more exciting now than it's ever been. You get to do absolutely anything. You can build cars, you can uh, build bridges, you can build buildings. Going down to the test side in testing different areas, it's really exciting. There's so many areas of engineering, whether it's CAD, tool rooms. You can do welding, you can be an assembler, you can be a fitter. It's a new job in every day, a new job every other hour. One day I can be on the computers and another day I can be down at the test side, fixing things hands on. You can go from welding valves to heat treating to literally anything. Your mind's always occupied, you've always got something to do throughout the day. What I like is how big the job is. When you've made something you think, yeah, I've made that. That's going into an oil rig, for instance, here. Or up for that bridge, which is standing, it would be still there in a couple of hundred years. And you get a good feeling from that, a really good feeling. Well, apprenticeships give the option of earning money whilst learning a trade. And at the end of it, come out with diplomas, degrees. Give me a universal qualification that I could use all around the world. I know more about the workplace itself how the company works and how business works. You've already got your skills so they don't have to train you, you can go straight into another job. Instead of starting your practical life at 20, you can start it at 17 through an apprenticeship, become an advanced machinist earlier on in your life and be a better one at that. The best part of being an apprentice, I'd say, is the amount I've learnt in so little time. I've got a programme which sends them all the way around the factory over a period of about three years. And they'll sit you down and say, which one did you fancy the most? What do you want to go into? And that's where eventually you'll end up with a full-time job, as long as you stick at it. Well, for me, Elite College is one of the best colleges in the area. They offer amazing facilities, such as the workshop, where there's lace and milling machines and all sorts of hand-on tools as well. The facilities at Lee College are absolutely brilliant. They fit the bell, basically. There's up-to-date computers, the workshop's fully kitted out. It's just like going to the workplace, really. You get treated as an equal. You get treated as a professional. We have a laugh, but we get a lot of hard work done at the same time. The lecturers are absolutely brilliant. They've got a lot of experience within industry, and they follow that through in the way they teach the lessons. Through this course, they can sort you out an apprenticeship, get you into the industry that you want to be working in. I would definitely recommend engineering to anyone who didn't actually know what they were doing when they were at school, because I just went straight into applying for apprenticeships, and I'm really enjoying it. If you're considering becoming an engineer, take my advice that it is a good option to do. Be prepared for hands-on work. I mean, I go in with black face, black hands all the time, but it is worth it. It's brilliant. Get on an apprenticeship scheme. Arrange a work experience week in the engineering industry. I've got to see them come from college wanting to do engineering. That tells me and the company that they're a good investment for the future. And that's the way forward.